Hi everybody, welcome to German Auto House. We specialize on supercar, exotic car, service, repair and performance. Ring that bell to have more content, subscribe to our channel. And today we have BMW i8. A uh, couple years ago the last i8 what we did we swapped the engine. But this car came for different problem it's not service this is let's say it's a big repair for this car and i give you some idea what happens happens problem with the ac compressor uh, they broke and stop working and some worn inside problem with piston i have no idea but all metal shaving going to whole system and of course uh, if you know guys if you don't know uh, the AC system is not only for passenger and for driver this is AC system for cooling down the big battery what is hybrid uh, for hybrid system and of course car stop works uh, the electric system have malfunction and uh, now it's just like the gasoline engine sometime for long period when the car is cold the system start works but when the temperature of the battery reach some special temperature they shut off and no more hybrid system uh, here is the trouble code i just uh, pulled diagnostic and here is the trouble code you can see uh, let's move right there it's about the first one AC refrigerant pressure sensor refrigerant high voltage high voltage refrigerant and if you're going down more about the high voltage switch off electrical system malfunction and of course again about AC the car has been at our uh, dealer BMW and this is the numbers what we have from them and this is the total one 17 let me zoom I'm sorry 17,000 little bit over 17,000 for this repair what we need to do here is the all parts this is the two coolers from top to the battery and bottom the battery here is the switch valve here is the AC com condenser and here is the AC compressor uh, we have to discharge whole system pull out the battery reassemble the battery replace the two coolers install everything back re replace AC condenser clean whole system any hoses and pipes what we still have of course switch off valve we have to replace it too this is our plan and today i want to start work on this car and pull apart let's start save money to customer before start work on hybrid system we have to disconnect the energize the battery here is the procedure and here is the socket connector right there and the system have to be in sleep mode before we disconnect and then we, we can we have to check if this is the warning indicator here is the socket this is what we have to do we have to unplug this socket i'm sorry guys i, I still need to remove this hood now i disconnect the open that socket and put the zip tie to avoid any connection anyway we have to disconnect the whole battery uh, and now let's let's check and me i think we have we get the warning okay see this is the high voltage system deactivated okay now start removing the battery i need to remove this hood because i don't have any access the ac compressor on this side 
right there, deep inside. Anyway, I have to remove this air duct and hood because this is the maximum level what I can open. All see everything is prepared before battery removal, the front cover and uh, support this cover and the rear. I don't want to say this is the subframe, this is aluminum skid plate and the front too. Already prepared it and I hope I not damage nothing. I just want to inspect a little bit how is everything going and I need to, oh it's by the way the system, AC system is already discharged. Okay, the battery is out. Now it's time to pull apart and replace two uh, radiator cooler, whatever you call it. We need to reassemble the whole things. We need to replace this uh, valve too, also. Okay, let's start pull apart. Here is the top piece already removed. You can see the three battery, the small battery unit right there. And here is the upper cooler like this. And now I need to remove three more unit and I have access to the uh, bottom cooler right there. we have access to the bottom piece let's replace this guy cooler let's remove this guy yep 
Ooh. And now, let's check what we got. I think one of the coolers is top and the other one is bottom. Looks like this is the top piece, yes. Let's move this top piece on because we need a little bit later. Oh, and here is the bottom piece. This is the top piece. Well guys, the battery pack is assembled back, new cooler scene, this is the old one right there, right here, and valve already new. Now we need to install back this battery pack and start to replace AC condenser and AC compressor.
Well, guys, already replaced everything. AC compressor. I didn't assemble it under hood. Bottom is done, uh, except one skid plate, aluminum one, because I drained the coolant. I want to clean and make sure no any leaks. But for now, I already uh, connect the high power and battery, and I charge the AC, fill the uh, engine oil, and now let's check how is everything works, and then I can reset the trouble code actually. Just fire up the engine. I'm gonna check the how is the AC blows. Mm, it's cold. Yeah, and I need to check the battery voltage. I wanna leave that car running if the battery starts charging. Oh. Now we can see the AC system start works actually. And pump is make some noise. Yeah. Making and blower start pumping. Um, Looks like we everything done. Just need to make sure the system working properly, no any trouble code. I need to charge the battery and drive when the car is actually, let's say, at least 40, 50 miles, and especially on the battery mode because uh, we need to check how the system works. Because if the battery is not cooled down, our mission is not complete. But for me, now is everything good, we'll see. Well guys, <laughs> we already charge, I just drive around block and you can see we already have uh, four miles right there, yeah right there, four miles already. Now let's switch to eco mode. Echo Pro and just oh, already five miles. Yeah, and let's use the electric power. Let's drain the battery completely. Nice. It's funny, no sound. <laughs> Looks like everything done properly. Yeah, it's hella cool to drive the electric. <laughs> cool.